Did you know that Bayonetta didn't actually win the Smash Fighter ballot back in Smash 4? So if you don't already know, the final DLC slot for Smash 4 was decided by a fighter ballot. So basically anybody could go online and request their most wanted character for Smash, and the winner of that ballot was going to be the final DLC slot. Bayonetta finished first in Europe, but she only finished top 5 in the US, and she made it into the game because she was the highest placing character out of recognizable and realistic characters. That being said, it was actually Sora that won the Smash Fighter ballot, and later on when Sora was revealed for Smash Ultimate, Sakurai actually mentioned this in his direct presentation and he stated that they didn't want to reveal the actual results of the ballot because they didn't want people to harass the companies with these characters. It makes me wonder how the lifespan of Smash 4 would have gone if Sora would have been added instead of Bayonetta. 